Ladies and gentlemen, I am the Nerdy Gamer Nerd, and I am here to play some Pokemon. Competitive Pokemon, actually. On Pokemon Showdown, a site that a bunch of you might be familiar with. Um, so, I'm not gonna lie, I've recorded this three times with different programs, and I didn't really like, not even the way the battles went, because I did win one, I lost one, and I was fine uploading losers. But one of the problems was, if one of them fucked up with the fucking uh, the, the, like the aspect of the size of the video. Like basically, what you can see now is a tiny part of the screen where the battle will take place, rather than the full screen with a massive chat. Then the other one cut out halfway through a bloody recording when I was fucking finishing off the battle, and I just couldn't be asked. So now I've fucking fixed it, and I've got it all done. Anywho, we're gonna be playing Are You Tier with a nice little team that I, well, I can't say that I made personally on my own because I did get some help off Smogon, but this isn't a direct team. I did actually throw a bunch of things in here myself. For example, the main Edric and the Sceptile and the Agron. Uh, because I love Agron. Agron is badass. Although the Yuxi and the Feraligator are straight from them. Uh, straight from the Smogon and the end tier was a last minute add on that I just took from the fact that I was like, what should I take? What should I take? I'll see. And then I just was like, yeah, well, I need fire. End tier. So, yeah. And uh, it's taking forever to find me a match again. Uh, right. There we go. Okay, we got ourselves a match. Okay, against it, to be fair. Not a great team. That not do. That I'm not even sure what is happening. I really don't know what this what his team is. All I know is this is how it's gonna work. I'm gonna set up with a trick or not, but I'm gonna set up with trick to move choice scarf onto him. I just took his evil light off him, which makes which gives him his extra damage. He's probably pissed on top of that. He bounced his paralysis back at me. But a field is toxic. Where is it gonna bounce again? I don't think it will because he swapped out into his Aerodactyl. So now I put Parahax on his Aerodactyl. I've took the Evital off it. He can't. But he has to swap out. Unfortunately, he's forced me into using U-turn, which is not a good fucking move against this guy. But it's okay. It will all be fine. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to swap out into Entei. And Entei here is going to use Stone Edge. Uh, of course, he will probably swap out for sure. And I missed Stone Edge, unbelievably. And unfortunately, this Entei is choice banded. choice banded, so he has to fucking hit. And unfortunately, we actually hit this time and one shot that guy. Now, if I have luck on my side, which I never do, I would have been able to one-shot that Charizard as well, but I did not. Anyway, we'll move out in a Feraligator, which he's definitely not going to be happy with, so he swaps out, giving me the chance to activate a Swords Dance. On top of that, I'm going to use Waterfall, which is a pretty powerful move, and I managed to get the crit off and one-shot his Golbat as well. Now comes out this weird fucking thing that I can't actually, well, when I say I can't actually say I've seen it before, I have... But I haven't actually battled it competitively, and I'm not, I'm afraid that it might have some decent actual moves, Mandibuzz. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit it with Aqua Jet. That did no damage, unfortunately. I feel like this guy will, is probably physically, uh, physically built for defense. But we'll see. Toxic, not a good fucking position for me to be in. But fortunately, another few waterfalls has taken this guy down. I'm going to keep Feraligator in, simply because this guy has came out, allowing me to hit an Aqua Jet, which is super effective, and of course hits the 100% KO. Uh, at this point, it looks like I've got a pretty easy victory, to be honest. Uh, nothing too special. This, this Squawks guy is now forced into doing whatever attack comes to his mind, and he's pretty weak. And for, wow, he actually managed to hit, and he's forced into roosting. If he's going to constantly roost, let that be the case. I'm going to Swords Dance once more. And that, po that Toxic is getting powerfuler 
and powerful at each turn. Not so good, because it will kill me next turn no matter fucking what. So I have to hit the Aqua Jet for 56. Thank Lord. I took that guy out, but for Alligator, took the fight down with him, and unfortunately, we lost him in the battle. Fortunately, this dude's only Pokemon left is Noctowl, and I have a main entry to deal with that. And believe it or not, I didn't do enough to destroy it in. Well, destroy is a bit of a harsh word, I should say defeat. Uh, I do not want to be toxic with Minetric. To be honest, the swap out was not intentional, but Void, uh, void Switch? Volt Switch was the only move that was I had that would do damage, to be perfectly honest. Uh, now I'm going to use Trick again, because I want that leftovers away from him, and I'm going to give him a useless item. Throwing Stealth Rock out was useless, and I don't know why I just did that. I'm stupid. And he forfeited because he knew I was going to win anyway. Unfortunately, he couldn't take the defeat, but he knew what was going to happen. I definitely was going to win no matter what because he was full paralyzed by the looks of it. Unfortunately, he couldn't play it out to the end like a good sport, but that's alright. I honestly don't blame him. I'm not going to be sitting here and going, oh man, come on, don't be that guy. Actually, yeah, I am. Don't be that guy. Don't forfeit just because you didn't uh, win. Seriously. I've had dudes where I've just fucking will o wisp their Lucario and they're just like, oh, nope, quit, I'm done, I'm fucking done. And that's really annoying, especially when you're on your fucking second Pokemon. My god, some people are bad. Or at least fucking sore losers. Anyway, um, I would say it's time for another game, but I'm not wanting videos to run on, so I'm gonna stop here. Uh, and we'll move on to the next battle with this exact same team and we'll see how many games we can get before we lose anyway guys